Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Odessa. Good morning, baby. We have to go to the doctor. Oh. She's like, why did you wake me up, mommy? <laughs> now I feel bad. Don't worry, Odessa. You can sleep in the car. Yeah. Let's go. Now <laughs> she's so happy now. <laughs> Let's get you strapped in so you're safe going down the road. Yeah. There you go, baby girl. We are here in Morgantown. Odessa is having an MRI. It is a sedated MRI. So she does have to be put to sleep for it, obviously, because she's a baby. She's not gonna stay still for an hour-long MRI. There's always a risk with anesthesia. Mm -hmm. This will be her first time getting it, so I'm a little bit nervous, but mm -hmm. I'm sure she'll be fine. Um, so she's starting to be a little fussy. Okay, she didn't cry the entire three-hour drive, and as soon as we parked, she's like, get me out of here, I am done. <laughs> Mommy's gonna get you in a minute. <laughs> um, Leon is actually with us as well because tomorrow he has a doctor appointment also in Morgantown. So what we did is we are just going to do Odessa's appointment today, stay in the hotel, and then tomorrow do Leon's appointment and then come home. And if you're wondering why she's getting the MRI, she has a tethered spinal cord. She has this tiny, like little, almost insignificant place on her back. Um, and they did an ultrasound at birth and they were like, oh, it's a, it's a tethered spinal cord. She's going to need it clipped. She's going to need surgery. So the MRI is just to like map out the surgery. Cause obviously it's so different for every patient. So they really need like a good picture and her surgery is June 12th. And today is the 31st of May, so they wanted to get the MRI as up to date as possible before her surgery. Leon is so excited to get out of the car. Are you ready, buddy? Look at him, he's so happy. <laughs> I don't know if he's happy to get out or if he's happy to see you. I think it's a combination of both. <laughs> I love you, little man. <laughs> what about you, Dessa? Hi, sweetie. Oh, <laughs> she's doing so good. I know. I'm so happy. Okay. That was fast. <laughs> oh, teeny elevators. <laughs> Scan it again. Again. Yeah, scan it again. And four. Here we go. Off to the imaging center. Oh, services. I don't know why I read it as center. What are you reading about, buddy? What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars. Mm. Maybe the birds will sing about your heart. Maybe the trees will whisper the word. Maybe the sun will spread your joy to the ones who lost their hope. Odessa just went back to do her MRI. She actually was really happy the entire time. And I'm like surprised she did great, especially for being hungry, which I know she was. Now we're gonna go get some breakfast for little man. What is that? <laughs> he really likes that, doesn't he? Yeah. Let's go get food, come Let's on. Go. Come on, let's go this way. <laughs> He's like, I don't wanna leave this, I really like it. 
Can we just take a minute to talk about the fact that a hospital cafeteria has yogurt that doesn't look amazing right now, but it, it looks so amazing. Look at the strawberries, the chocolates, the coconut. Look at Leon's. Leon's has raspberry, blueberries. Leon's face, he he's waiting. like, um, hello mom, give me some more of that stuff. Is that good? Yeah. They had an entire bar of like all these different fruits and toppings and stuff. Two different kinds of yogurt, granola. What'd you get? I got the same thing. I just didn't oh, get okay. I didn't get chocolate. No chocolate, yeah. yeah. But now for the taste test. Mm. Leon seems to like it. Mm -hmm. You're gonna like that. It's so good. Is it good, buddy? Well, that was delicious. What do you think? <laughs> Oh, you want more? He's still hungry. <laughs> I'll go get you some more, Bubby. Okay, Mr. Man. <laughs> He's so happy. I got you some cheese bits and another applesauce. You want to eat the applesauce? Applesauce is like his favorite. <laughs> He's so excited. <laughs> they are kind of small, aren't they? Yeah. I feel like they're normally bigger than that. Can I get the same thing? There you go, buddy. Is that better? I figured he could eat the little cheese bits like in the waiting room. So, okay, let's go. Fourth floor. And we're back. Going down. No, we're not. We are giving off. We are so happy now. <laughs> Are you happy that you got breakfast? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Odessa's MRI is over. She did wonderfully, didn't even cry, woke up fine, chugged a bottle. So now we are here waiting for her doctor appointment follow up. Odessa. <laughs> Odessa. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and what is Mr. Leon doing? Something he's not supposed mm -hmm. to. Of course. Mm -hmm. Look at him. He's like, uh-oh, I got caught. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Every time with the paper, huh, does a girl? Yeah, I see you. <laughs> Look at that belly hanging over the diaper. See, Look that's a that. healthy belly. Look at that belly. <laughs> It's full of watermelon. <laughs> Is that what you were feeding her? Yeah. Was watermelon? Mm -hmm. Watermelon and broccoli. Oh, yummy. Yeah. You like broccoli? Uh, broccoli? Yeah? Oh, my baby girl. It's been a tough day. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. That's how you know you've had a long day at the doctor. I see. Poor little baby. What did he hand you? A piece of trash. A piece of trash. <laughs> Now that we are back from all of Little Miss Odessa's appointments today, she's so sleepy, oh my goodness. I wanted to show you guys her MRI. So it's kind of a dark picture and it's a little crinkled, so I don't know how well you're going to be able to see it, but you should be able to get like the gist of it. So this is her back and this part right here is like the fatty lumpy mass the tethered spinal cord that they have to remove and it actually is connecting to her spinal cord here and stretching it and pulling it farther down than it's supposed to be so they have to remove all of this area and he said that it's a pretty like straightforward easy surgery he's done a lot of them Hers doesn't look like complex or complicated or anything like that which is really really good um but it's a surgery there's always risks so i try not to think about it too much but um he booked her from 7 to 11 right yes 7 to 11 so four hours long i guess that's kind of like standard um she'll stay in the hospital for like two to three days afterwards obviously i'm going to stay with her the entire time and then after that she's going to have an incision and i have to 
keep it clean and all that she's gonna have dissolving stitches so she's not gonna have to go back and get stitches out or anything which is really good um, it's mostly just difficult to keep clean because it's like in her diaper area literally her diaper covers that area of her back so it's gonna be a little difficult but very doable she's going to be on antibiotics actually just to help prevent any kind of infection her surgery date is already set it's set for june 12th so they're going to get her in really soon um he said there's a 30 percent chance that it could grow back and she could need surgery again in the future but i think that's a pretty low chance thankfully so i'm hoping Obviously that doesn't happen in her case, but she's going to get surgery and she's going to be fine. If you made it to this point in our video, you know it's time for our birthday shout outs. Happy birthday to Tori and happy birthday to Jade. Thank you all so much for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, and if you'd like, become a member. And we'll see you in our next video. Bye guys.